Hey, Ms. Athos, Paul Zigo here. Hi, Paul Zigo! Uh, this tactic that you've been using lately of um, acting like you don't give a shit whether or not you're taken seriously or that you don't care um, is a tactic that sometimes young adolescent kids will use when they I want the new toy, mommy! 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 Um, you know, a lot of the things that you've said uh, regarding the ASU directly contradict that. Okay. You have uh, you've presented the ASU as something that you care very deeply about. I do. That you hope that someday um, will affect real change in society. Real change in and yet, society. When you're confronted with the very real question, a question that I think that the figurehead or spokesman for a movement um, should be able to answer, the question being, how do you expect to be taken seriously? And you have to realize, right, that you're going to have to be taken seriously, that you have to realize that. Here's the question, my good friend Paul's ego. Here's the question you have to ask yourself. Does one have to be serious to be serious? Contemplate this on the tree of woe. <laughs> That's basketball going on in the background. That's basketball, right, Scotty? Shut up, TJ. Shut up. Why are you so mean to me? Uh, am I right? Um, one of the stated goals of your organization is to get legislation passed in this country. And we're not talking about small-scale small uh, local scale legislation. No, no. We're talking about national, national legislation no. banning the indoctrination of children. Come here, Scotty. Which, by Why the, the way, is ridiculous. Why the fuck is your shit blurred, you stupid fuck? Doesn't look cool. You look like a fucking retard. Look at me. I have fucking second-rate special effects. Woo! And not be, hey, and not have you been taken seriously. You can compare yourself, uh, you can compare yourself to the Black Panther them. Party, That's not um, who were taken very seriously That's in this right. country. They're taken seriously for some of the wrong reasons, but um, I don't think that they were looked on as clowns, and I think that at this point, the way that you've been portraying yourself, you're going to be looked on as an ass clown. And it's fine if you don't give a shit. It's fine if it's true that you really don't give a shit what people think and you don't care if people take you seriously. Um, and all you want to do is just make some really crazy videos on YouTube and you want to gather a bunch of atheists together that, that also want to make some crazy videos and you want to you want to pick logos that you know nothing about and, and you want to get called out about it you want to toss off the criticism and not really answer video. the question and, and just kind of flippantly bullshit your way through the answer and maybe pull out your man titties and juggle them for the camera a little bit. That's fine well, dandy, the ball, if that's the that? way that you want to be perceived. <laughs> but looking at some of your earlier videos, I don't think I that am. that's the case. I think that you really do care a lot about the ASU. I think that you really do hope that it's going to affect real change in society. And so I guess my question is, which one is it? Both! Which one Yay! Is it? Both of those things are true. Welcome to the paradox. Society will eventually take seriously, or is it just something that you're, you know? No, 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 no. People take things too seriously. with? Is it just something that you're fucking around with? Both of the above. Both of the above. See, motherfucker. See, give two shits in the fuck about what people think because it's not really serious in the first place. All of the above. All of the above. Don't you? I don't really expect a serious answer to this video, but. Good, because you ain't getting one! Ha ha! Fuck you! Fuck yeah. you, you stupid piece of fucking shit! Oh, don't be mean to him, he's just voicing his concerns.